Hey guys, just wanted to share with you, we got to our, our door here, and when we got the door, um, it had this laminate film on it, that plastic film on it, which is very, very uh, cloudy. I don't know if any of you guys are having the same issue or not. Here, you can see right here. This is a part of the glass that's actually still clear, and the whole glass is foggy. So I heard about some people that actually take it off because they don't need it. I guess it has some kind of ballistic features. I'm not sure what. But I just wanted to share with you guys um, that um, we're, we're trying to take it off because you can't really see much. Here, put your hand behind. Yeah, I can't really see much. It's not clear. So we started to take it off and I wanted to share with you guys um, the process. So and hopefully... If you guys got the same issue, it might be helpful for you. So we started to use the heat gun and, and guys, this is pretty serious. I don't know, I think it's some kind of um, film. Yeah, we're gonna start to heat it up and completely take it off and uh, let you guys know how it works. So this, this is actually separating it, which is good. And we're gonna try to pull it. Guys, this is crazy. Once you stop heating it up, this is like, I mean, this is pretty serious. And there is some kind of like a glue underneath that, some rubberish glue, but that's amazing. So I can totally see how that would stop some little things, not much, but this is a pretty serious thick plastic. Yeah. So we've been trying to get this glass laminate off but it doesn't work and we try to get the whole glass out but it doesn't work because one screw won't come off of this so we're trying to get this bottom piece off and maybe we'll be able to slide the window off yes So we managed to get the window off from the bottom part. This guy right here still stuck. I can't get it off, but we're probably going to be able to do it now. Don't lose those rollers. I don't know where you get new ones. But yeah, window is off. This is what came out. I mean, this thing is thick. We weren't expecting this to come off of the glass, but yeah, that's what came off. So we lost some thickness in the glass, and I'm not sure, I think there is two different types of windows. One is thicker, but yeah, this is, this is what we got. So underneath your plastic layer, we got a jelly layer, which is this rubber. I don't know much about our glass, but I'm sure this has some kind of and of ballistics, but yeah, it has, has a meaning why it has all that layers of, of shit on it. <laughs> Let's try to pull it off. This is actually a pretty good experiment. Turned out to be a disaster. I don't think we'll be able to recover this glass, but it's nice to just see what's inside. This is a nightmare to take off. It doesn't come off. 
could be because of the heat. This side is coming off now. Wow. Yep. So this is what came out. Crazy. And it sticks to itself. <laughs> Just sticks to itself. So yeah, that's what we had to deal with. One, two, hard. And <laughs> window. There is our window. So this is the window. We don't know if this is tempered window or not, or we don't know what's the deal here. I think while I use the pliers, I may have caused some damage to the window, but this is it. So now we'll think what to do with it. There you go, guys. Easy steps to know what's inside your Humvee window or what's inside your door, which is the hungry window, which apparently has many layers in it. All right guys, so the original plan was to get this cloudiness that we had on the glass uh, off. And I've heard some rumors and some, some things about people using heat gun uh, to, to take this film off, this like laminate film, or I'm not sure what it is, but we tried that. And guys, like you've seen before how it went, we went through this, which that thing is like hard. So we went through this and then we got into that like rubber film that was right behind it, which is this thing. And we tried to pull this off the glass, it didn't work, we tried to break it, we tried everything. And then we got to this and we tried to heat it with a heat gun, which didn't work. We tried to cut it, which didn't work. Eventually we managed to separate it, just barely. But it was a nightmare. So, really, the next thing was to think what to do with the glass. We wanted to put it back on the door and basically use it on the Humvee. But I was concerned that maybe at some point it would break uh, because now it doesn't have any of that protection film on it and I didn't want it to break and maybe hurt someone. So the one million dollar question is, is it tempered glass or it's not? Is it safety glass that would break into uh, one million pieces or it's gonna break into big pieces which gonna very much injure someone? So that's the one million dollar question. So there is only one way to determine which one it is and it's to break it. So here, that's the glass. And we're gonna give the honor to you. Right there. Me? You, yes. All right. So let's do this. All right, getting ready, getting ready. Safety first, safety first. <laughs> So, here's the glass. Tempered or not tempered? That's the question. Let's do this. Ooh. Now that was a very light tap. Very light tap, very light tap. And this is what happened. It broke immediately. And yep, and that's exactly why we didn't want to put it in a Humvee because if it would break this is going to um, yeah 
cause some damage to someone. So, there you go, guys. Now you have it. I really didn't think that I would manage to break it to begin with. That yeah. was such a light tap with the hammer there. So right. That's, that's pretty concerning. I know. I, I was surprised, too. I thought it would take a little bit more, but I guess that these guys, these two layers, are supposed to really protect it and um, make sure that this won't happen. But holy moly, look at this thing. Somebody can easily get impelled by this. Very dangerous. So there you go. Humvee window is not that safe as we thought if it's without those layers again we're not experts we just uh, love the adventure all right so 